Hey guys, Ryan Anderson here out on Leech Lake in Walker, Minnesota. I picked up the Vraybill Viper tip-up and I wanted to show you guys it in action. We got our setup here. You got your light switch here. You can see, nice and bright. You got your bubbler, your aerator, which the hose comes out of the back and the bottom. I recommend making sure it's fully secure when putting it on. On each side of the inside, you have a spot to put your hook. As you can see, I already have my minnow set up on here. This spool is very easy to reel on. You can take it off and spool it up or leave it on there and spool it. And what's really nice is with this opening, I can put my Vexlar in there so I'm checking my depth. So I'm gonna let this go down, set my Vexlar in here. <clears throat> As you can see, it's getting towards the bottom. So when obviously when it gets down there, reel this back in a little bit. I personally like to fish maybe a foot off the bottom. And sorry for the camera. I'm doing it by myself. But if you do then, as there's your flag, it's set up. Once that fish gets on, that flag's gonna go popping right up. I used it yesterday. Uh, weather was about the same. Uh, I did notice that it frosts up a little bit on the inside, but the lid does not freeze to the unit itself. Um, then again, we haven't had negative weather yet, so I can't really say for sure if it's going to freeze. But the aerator does its job by keeping that water nice and clear. I just didn't scoop all the slush out, that's why there's some in there. And again, apologize in advance for the audio and video. I don't normally make YouTube videos, but I've seen this as a new unit. No one had it yet, so I figured I'd give it a try. Um, the only videos I've seen online is one person setting it up and then the Fraybell team showing it in action. Um, I will say that it will not sit on top of or inside of a five gallon bucket. It is actually just wide enough to where it sits on top of it but it won't be secure it will fall off so transportation wise i really haven't figured out the best method yet um i just kind of set it in my sled for now so but yeah hopefully you guys enjoy this video and hopefully i can post some more about it thanks again